Dan, you are live, so no picking your nose or anything like that. Everyone's watching. And That's we have fine. all been Let me waiting. adjust my hat. <laughs> yeah, we've been all waiting for this moment. It's really exciting. How many, how many well, times have you guys actually done an, a limited edition game? I mean, that's not as common as the others, numerous, right? Too numerous to um, even yeah. count. Um, we never actually thought to count that, so thank you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but right. if we could get limited edition machines, we uh, hop on that uh, chance to give something special away. We were able to get two Led Zeppelin uh, LEs early, and here we go. We were able to sell out two of them uh, so people could win it. So we're super happy. Awesome. So, Everyone super in the happy. chat is saying hi, Daniel. Oh, really? Yeah. Happy New Year <laughs> to everybody. But I, I was listening in, and, you know, Steve and Tim, they were just so Weren't much. Weren't they so great? So exciting. You know, Tim really took off just talking about the rules. Even though he didn't want to, but Kyle pushed him, he went there. <laughs> a little I mean, bit. It was great to Yeah, see. and if anyone really wants to hear that deep dive in the rules, Tim and Jeff Giolis did a great talk on Pinball Profile. Yeah. Oh, wow. Kind of like it goes through all of that and stuff. So okay, thank you out. for telling me. Yeah. You guys really were doing excited. a great I, job. I love how excited they are for this game. You know, it really shows... Oh, you could definitely tell. Just listen to them. Um, it was just a great show. You guys did a great job. Cal, you know, you did a great job as well. Even though you might be shy, it doesn't show. Because your, your excitement's there for everybody else that's behind, you know, on their keyboards and what have you. So good job, Cal. Thank you. Kyle's always like, he doesn't know what to expect because he doesn't really see the chat. So he just hopes that I'll let him know what's going yeah. on. And hope that I'm you always too scared to good. watch it afterwards. So I always just tell Moto, it's like, what did people say? I know. <laughs> yeah. yeah, everyone throw Kyle emotes in the Twitch chat. Oh. We but yes, I'm not in my office. You know, um, I want to take some downtime. We did just get off the road on December 15th. And you could still hear my voice is a little stressed out from being on the road, but we achieved something really great that we were hoping that other people could relate to. And I know Kyle was saying that he was uh, super happy about the two machines that we were able to place in South Carolina. So are we. We had such great support over the years, and we had a couple false starts. But this year, it all came together. Uh, they wanted it to happen. Uh, even with uh, COVID and yeah, despite uh, stuff like that, we made it ultra safe. We were COVID-free in the beginning. We were COVID-free during. And I took uh, two tests since I've been back, and we're COVID-free still. So, yeah. you know, we achieved everything that we wanted to. We placed nine machines, or I'm sorry, seven machines. Um, I'm thinking of 2021, so I let the cat <laughs> on the back. <laughs> but, yes, we are looking to dedicate nine machines uh, as soon as we possibly can in 2021. So you heard it here first uh, from me. Awesome. But uh, we did dedicate seven machines in uh, 15 days. So we're quite happy about that. We're receiving positive and I wasn't feedback already. And it was just fantastic. I want to thank Komodo for helping us present that. Uh, interviewing us on the road. Jeff Teolis uh, also reached out to us. So uh, thank you to everybody that supported us. Um, but thank you to everybody out there that helps us through these raffles and, you know, just uh, kind donations to make this possible. So thank you. Uh, everybody should feel good with, uh, you know, all their help. It went to that and we're building on 2021. Mm -hmm. So, awesome. there you go. All right. Well, are you ready to do the drawings? Oh, you know I am. <laughs> I've been ready for this. And I want to thank everybody. Um, you know, this one sold out relatively quick. It was the first one that we did. We offered up a second one since we could get a, a second machine. And with Marco Pinball Specialties, um, they helped give us the push 
and it sold out. Uh, I uh, took a look at it like 12 hours. So thank you for all your help and thank you to everybody that uh, helped participate. So I have uh, both the lists here. This is part one, which we'll do first, and part two. So are we ready for this? Yeah, let's do it. We are ready. Okay. So I do have all 200 balls in here, just like we always do. And this is going to make a little bit of noise. So I'm going to shake it up. I'm not going to look. I'm going to pull a lucky uh, number out and correspond it with the, the very first sheet here. Then I'll put it back in, and then I'll draw on the second one. How's that? Sounds great. You ready? Yeah. And we do have the two names. We wrote them in here that uh, you guys drew earlier, so they are included in here. So everybody cross their fingers. <laughs> and we're going to proceed right now. So I apologize for it being noisy. Okay. Can get I got to find the key. I'm not looking. Okay, I got a lucky winner right here. Can everybody Number see 40. it? Lucky forty. Forty. So Okay, I'm going to keep this on the table for a moment. Oh, wow. Oh, he got it. Oh, wow. I love oh, wow. Okay, everybody's going to recognize these people because they actually uh, give back to the pinball community. It is actually the mod couple. They're Whoa. the ones that all the mods for the machines and everything like that. So they made awesome. the, didn't they make that awesome uh, cologne that one time? What was it? The cologne? Yeah, right? I they think that they awesome. did. I recall hearing about they that. They came with a little but mini. As you can see, they were number 40. So. Uh -huh. Wow. Congratulations. congratulations. That's the mod awesome. couple. So they win their sales a Led Zeppelin limited edition machine. Okay, I'm putting this back in, as everybody can see. All right. I'm, I'm going to shake it up machine. again. Amazing. On so, the second raffle, I saw a lot of people's names I recognized, too. So good luck, everybody. I just got to keep my eyes on this computer. I can't stand there anymore. Don't pick I'm number digging four. in. <laughs> and we just pulled lucky 33. 33. Oh, right? That is a lucky Three. number. 33. Oh, my gosh. There's 200 balls in there, and you both picked. Well, with that, seven <laughs> units. <laughs> both, okay. with, out of 200 balls, you got two double-digit numbers. <laughs> well, one time, like, Dan should have went straight to Vegas because he kept pulling, like, the same number over and over again. <laughs> yeah, that was back to back. <laughs> okay. I think Mark wants to know that he won. Which Mark? Which Mark? Which Mark? Uh, hold on. Is the balls are rolling away. It looks like Nelson. Oops. Uh, it looks like Nelson. Um, so huh. we're going to contact these people. Whoops, sorry. Mark Nelson? Yeah. Is that what it says? That's what it looks like, Nelson. No. I don't have my glasses, so I apologize. Congratulations. But we're going to contact you guys uh, tomorrow uh, on New Year's Day. Sierra just learned of this uh, as I said it. But uh, she's going to reach out to the mod couple and Mark Nelson. So those are our two winners for this evening. So thank you to everybody that joined up. We appreciate your support. And best wishes to everybody in the coming year, 2021. So. Yeah, thank you so much, Daniel. That was awesome. Not a problem. We love you guys. Uh, keep doing what you're doing. And, you know, have a great new year. You awesome. too. Thank you. You too. I love that machine, by the way. I do too. <laughs>